Cells in our body are programmed to self-destruct when they grow old, making way for newer, healthier cells through a process called apoptosis. The P53 gene is one of the controlling factors of this process. However, when the cell is subjected to certain mutation-causing agents, this gene malfunctions, preventing apoptosis. Such zombie cells refuse to die and continue to multiply, spreading the disabled gene and replacing healthy working cells with undying, rapidly growing tumors. This is the disease that we call cancer. Recently, scientists discovered that a naturally occurring compound, Fe399, isolated from a filamentous fungus, Ascochyta, has anti-cancer properties. When applied to colorectal tumors, Fe399 was found to reinstate apoptosis in the cancer cells. However, owing to chemical complexities, Fe399 is difficult to purify, which means that it could not be synthesized in enough quantities to be useful in the market. Professor Isamu Shina, along with Dr. Takayuki Tonoi and his team from the Tokyo University of Science, decided to find a method to produce Fe399 through total synthesis. Total synthesis is the process of the complete chemical production of a complex molecule using commercially available precursors. To do this, they first synthetically designed the linear precursor of Fe399. Then, using their unique synthetic reagent called 2-methyl-6-nitrobenzoic anhydride, the research team synthesized Fe399 through a process called Sheena lactamization. With an overall yield of 20%, this technique is quite promising for future large-scale production plans. The efficacy of the Fe399 molecule in treating other cancers still needs to be verified along with evaluation of its biological activities and structures. But the scientists hope that this newly produced compound can provide an unprecedented treatment option for patients with colorectal cancer, improve disease outcomes, and enhance quality of life.